Roland Wallet's Almond Stories, and I'm here with Terry Smith. And it's about our fourth, fifth album. What is it called? Uh, Where Do I Go From Here is the name of the album. The name of this song is, is Go Ahead and Rain. Um, and it's just kind of a, a fun song about it raining and I don't have to get up and go work. Um, <laughs> You're a teacher, I understand that. Yeah, well, this was, you know, of course, if it were raining, you still had to go to work when you were a teacher. But when I was growing up, one of the major sins at our house was to be lazy. Uh, you know, it was probably higher on the offense list than murder. So, <laughs> um, so this is just, um, this is just kind of a fun song about uh, it's raining, I don't have to get up and mow the yard. Uh, so if I want to sleep late, then it's nobody's business but my own. Uh oh, and that's, yeah. that's pretty cool. It's it's like it's like it's like you'd get sick once in a while. So <laughs> yeah, right, right. I got a cold. I got a cold. Yeah. <laughs> and you wrote this back in Texas, right? Uh no, not in Texas, but uh, it's it's a pretty. It goes back in my. Uh, it goes back in your memory. So you yeah, wrote, it goes back a while. Yeah, yeah. But I've been in Nashville for 42 years, so. Yeah, a lot of songs have been written in Nashville. Haven't yeah, they? right. So. Uh, and and you and did you did you do this for some of your kids in school? <laughs> mm, it was, probably it was not. Just, uh, once in a while. It, it was the it was the days when you were given tests. <laughs> yeah. Once in a while, I would take my guitar to school, but it was not just for kicks. It was in connection with something that. Um, I was teaching. We used to have have to teach a unit on Arthur's Arthur's purpose, right. and so I'd use my uh, I'd use a couple of songs in because since I was the author, then I knew what my purpose was, and it was something that we tried to get across to the kids that uh, you may not be able to figure out what the author's purpose is, but the author knows. The author knows, and I I remember one thing. Some expert was telling what the author knew, and they brought the author there, and he told them, and the and the and the and the guy that that wrote the book says, "Well, you you didn't think that way." <laughs> that was, yeah, well, right, that was yeah, so funny. that's right, that's that's right. Uh, <laughs> so, when I was in <laughs> when I was in school, you know, the teacher would say, "Well, what is the author's hidden meaning?" And I thought, authors don't hide their meaning. They may not slap you in the face with it, but they don't set out and say, hmm, I think I will hide my meaning from the audience. They're, yeah, for me, when I, as I wrote poems, it was like, I was like, I had just a tough time just giving them the message. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> so. so that was the same with you. Huh? Yeah. Well, yeah, but, but then, you know, somewhere down the road, Terry Smith's hidden agenda. Yeah, right. <laughs> Anyway, this let's sing the song. It's called Go Ahead and Rain. <laughs> 